guys. Um, welcome back to my channel. I'm in Manhattan. I had an appointment today, so let me have an appointment. It didn't go, it didn't last very long. So I'm headed to the oldest Japanese grocery store in New York City. And, uh, and I think in America too. But I'll double check with that. But um, they sell the, I'm going in to get these rice balls that they sell. It's really, really good. I'm going to give you guys a little glimpse of that. It's a very small store. They have a few grocery items. But they also sell, um, like I said, these amazing rice balls. And um, the ramen, the noodle soup. So I'm going to give you guys a glimpse of that. All right. All right this is the store. I never had the ramen. But um, this is the store right here. So. Thanks for the light, please. Hi. Um, so these are the rice balls that they have. They're amazing. It's a very small store. These are the different rice balls that they have. Um, can I get? Let me see what's inside of it first. I'm looking to see what's inside. Oh, like, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So I'm getting the bomb. So I got that one. So area. Sorry. And like I said, it's a grocery store, so. This they have, these are the fresh produce. Like I said, these are the noodles that you can use to make the udon soup or ramen soup. The fresh packs you can use. Buy the fresh pack. Like I said, if you get an opportunity, come and visit this store. It's really cute. I'll give you guys, uh, I'll tell you guys where it is in a minute. Freezer section, another part of the store. Where you have the fresh meat in the back. Fish. which is fish eggs, <laughs> sushi, into sushi, and these are the snacks. So also dessert, I think they're called munchies, but I don't too care for this. Cakes. These are the hot food that they sell. Excuse me. Thank you. So I just left. Like I said, this is a place. I'll let you guys know where it is. I'm gonna head now to um, Bryan Park and sit down and eat. And then I'm gonna head to, um, I'll tell you guys where I'm headed to when I sit down and eat. All right, okay guys, I'm sitting down in Bryan Park to eat. And like I said, I just came from, as you know, I just came from the Japanese supermarket to get something to eat. I got this to drink, it's a good drink. Oh, no. And I'm going to eat one of the rice balls and I'm going to show you the rice ball. See, it's this big. Now I'm going to open it and show you what's inside of it. This is what's inside of it. It's salmon and some type of seaweed. Mm. 
It's really good. So, that's what I'm having for lunch. It's after one, going on two o'clock. Oh. I hope you guys can see the sun just came out really bright. This is not really the chopsticks, but because I'm outside, these are really good. It seems like I'm eating on this channel. But, gotta eat. Alright? And when I'm done, I'm gonna go to. Louis Vuitton and pick up something that I bought. Um, so, after that, that's where I'm headed. I want to give you guys a little PSA. When you're in New York and in Bryant Park, they have the cleanest bath, public bathroom in the city as far as I know. I, I don't know if there's any other. If you guys know of any, leave it in the comments. The cleanest bathroom. And you don't have to pay for it. You may have to wait a while in line, but very clean. A public space in New York City. So, like I said, this is the rice ball. One is really, one is good if you're really hungry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe you get one of these and something else, but. It's really sufficient, very delicious. As you guys know, I like sitting in the sun, so it's gonna be much happier than what I am right now. Okay, it's a lot of rice. You gotta like rice to like this. Remember, it's called a rice ball. Japanese rice ball. I think that's the name of it. No, this one is called a bami. I'm sorry, it's called a bami or something like that. Yeah. So. Turn the camera around and show you guys the Oculus. I'm not gonna discuss this too much because I didn't come here to. I'm gonna do that in another video, explain the area over here. But so it is the Oculus. It's a beautiful, beautiful building. I have a lot of respect for this area due to what happened many years ago. I know you guys know what happened many years ago. So 9/11. So I don't like to record too much in this era because I have a lot of respect for it because of what took place. So, like I said, I'm going to Louis Vuitton because I'm picking something up that I purchased online. But first, I'm going to stop off at um, H&M just to see what they have. Why not? Because I'm in the area. So, like I said, I'm in H&M. So, that looks really warm. Let me see what the men have because the women department don't have much, nothing, no, nothing interesting. So that's cute. What if my son looked like this? It has a hoodie. That's nice. Look, see, the men always have better clothes sometimes. Look at that. Look at this coat. Like I 
like I told you, I'm about to go to pick up something from Louis Vuitton. And I'm going to Brookfield Plaza across the street. I don't know if you can see it. I can't because the sun is in my eyes. This is the West Side Highway. And behind me is the Oculus and the fountains over there to your right. And this right here, this building is where you go up um, to see, well, I forgot what you call that again. Um, I don't remember right now. Anyway, this is a luxury mall. And like I said, I'm not gonna explore it today. I'll do that another day. I don't know if you can see Gucci store way ahead. And that's the name of the mall, Brookfield Plaza. Brookfield Place, not Plaza. I don't want to say Plaza, it's Brookfield Place. Uh, this is what this place looks like. It's beautiful. It's a must if you're in New York City. Come visit this. And then you can go all the way in the back to see the Hudson River because there's restaurants back there. As you can see, they have Bottega, Gucci's over there. And like I said, I'm gonna do the town. So. I'm in Louie. Look at these pants. Wow. Yeah, this is pretty. A lot of new. Yeah, those are pretty too. I know they came out with a lot of new um, patterns and colors. How much is this? Gorgeous. Look at that. I didn't even realize these were scarves. So, so just like the other shawls. Mm -hmm. Can I see how big it is? Yeah. The yeah, because I mean, even though red is my favorite color. Looks like a nice. Oh wow, that's huge. It's like a good shawl. Yeah. Yeah, that's big. That's beautiful. Wow. Okay. That's nice. Oh, I've never seen this. With the white handle, wow. This is new. This is new. Oh, wow. This is the 25, right? Yeah. Oh, just the only color it comes in is the white? It's like the Serena Williams collection. Oh, there's a Serena Williams? No, no, no. Well, I'm getting a little inspired. under a rock. It's not actually I was kidding. It's tennis inspired though. <laughs> it comes with a oh, wow. little tennis ball as a bag charm. Get out. And so like how it's much like is that? The lines of the court. It comes with the bag. How much is it? No, how much is the bag? Let me check right now. Nothing like a bandolier. Twenty two forty. Wow. And then the white is from like the lines of the tennis court. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the cutest thing ever. Wow. Okay now. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't think yeah, that's like, why? Why would you, who told you to do that? It's retro, I think is the inspo. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, now that you, yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, you're right. It is retro. Is this new as well? I know! You can only get the one. This is the luggage. Look at that, that's pretty if you're into purple. It's like a compass or something. These are for the ballers. This is pretty, this is in the men's department. Look how pretty that is. Graphite. That's the black. Yes. Right. 
this is a very nice this is a very I think I'm gonna I might I'm gonna consider this one guys this is it for this vlog thank you for stopping by i would like you to like this video comment and share and press the notification bell so when i post another video you will be notified thank you bye